four days. Four men. Discriminate against people with facial hair because you won't answer questions? Eight cities. We do not know what the future holds down the concrete ribbon of highway. One van. Anyone you talk to understands the sexual dynamism of the mustached American lifestyle. One unforgettable ride. The Road to Stash Bash. Presented by the American Mustache Institute and Wall Trimmers. There's nothing more refreshing than bourbon, a bow tie, and a mustache in the morning as we as we set sail on our trek. Serious business. The hairy truth. It's 7 a.m. and it's time for the Mustached American Wake Up Call. We are not driving right now. This is an effect. One thing that strikes me is the voracious appetite of the Mustached American and how we are laser focused on our agenda. And that is ending the discrimination that plagues our people and has since William Howard Taft left office of the United States presidency in 1913. Good morning, we come to you from the Mustache Mobile Unit looking for some guidance as we move forward from St. Louis to Nashville in search of knowledge, rugged good looks, and an understanding of the deep discrimination that faces our people. And we should try to get every tractor trailer that we pass to the driver to blow the horn if he has a mustache. What are you, a seven-year-old girl? Jesus. I am the director of Academic Council uh -huh. for AMI. Excellent. So people look to me to cut through the bullshit. Actually, I, I, I always say, um, with great mustache comes great responsibility. So we're here in downtown Nashville on Broadway Street across from the Bridgestone Arena and we're going to be talking to people in Nashville about the perceptions of mustaches in the workplace. Does your workplace environment though, is it accepting of a mustached American lifestyle? Uh, you know, I don't think anybody that I work with has one that I can think of right off. Does that concern you? Does it concern me? I mean, if somebody wants to have a mustache, they should be able to have a mustache. Do you think there's more sexual dynamism that's associated with living a mustache American lifestyle? Uh, <laughs> I mean, I guess some people, I can see why some people would think that. Why did you find that question funny? <laughs> I noticed you uh, live a bare-faced lifestyle, and why do you choose to do that? Because uh, I, think, I think you seem like you have the ability to grow facial hair. I, I actually do, and I used to have a beard, but it, it's very gray. Excuse me, can I ask you a question about facial hair in the workplace? Are you an officer of the law? What is it about a mustache that you enjoy so much? Well, I also really like beards because I like to think that like a baby bird at any time could like nestle in there and lay some eggs, you know? It's like the circle of life like on your face though. Like you suffer from bare upper lip disorder or bold, is that true? Um, it's, it's not. What do you think of my facial hair? Is it very hygienic or just awesomely attractive? Awesomely attractive. That's what I'm talking about. My mustached American brethren, brothers of mustache, I have a question for you. My friend with a mustache. You can't just, don't turn your back on your people. The mustache by itself is like something you can like twirl. That's a little creepy, but yours is like, you got like a W going on. <laughs> I hear a lot of hate coming out of your mouth and I mean, I mean, is it related to your height? Is it? <laughs> you do know that it is written in the Dead Sea Scrolls that each time a mustache is shaved, an angel in heaven dies and falls to earth. I did not know that actually. That, though. Can't imagine somebody having a trouble with facial hair as long as it's well trimmed and groomed and looks acceptable. Hey, you're welcome, America. We just rolled in hot to Nashville. Very, very stash-friendly city. Got some great stuff, talked to some great people. Now we're going to get back in the van and we're going to cram it into, into Louisville. So watch out, Louisville. Stash Fest coming your way. One unforgettable ride. The Road to Stash Bash. Presented by the American Mustache Institute and Wall Trimmers.